All eyes now turn to Hurricane Maria. Here in Texas, victims from Hurricane Harvey are still recovering. Yeah, tonight, Fox 44's Noelle Mendoza introduces us to a family of seven who lost everything in the storm, was forced to relocate to Central Texas, and still struggling to find their way. The Wright family is starting over. It's been about a month since Hurricane Harvey hit, and they tell me they have nothing of their own. We put 10 years in there, and it, you know, took about six hours to destroy. Tommy and Patricia Wright sat down with me this morning in Gatesville to tell me their story. We were hoping that we, we would get back. to go straight back and clean up a little bit and get <laughs> everything, but when we got back, it was... We packed three days' worth of clothes just to stay, and then... He went back and it was gone. Their home is in Bayside, just northeast of Corpus Christi, in about four blocks from Copano Bay. It didn't take very many lives, but it sure it, it messed a lot of things up. They say their home is destroyed. And then everything, we went back two days later. And it was and mildew. Everything was just mold. It was just, it, All the windows yeah. shattered, so everything came in. The kids, whose ages range from 2 to 18, are in school, and Tommy tells me he's found a job and will start work on Monday but they still need help. Furniture, beds, um, yeah, furniture got ruined. Everything is, it was flooded, mildewed, um, everything on the floors, as far as like the beds, the clothes, she, everything was just ruined. They say FEMA hasn't provided them with anything yet. And on top of that, someone stole Tommy's identity. And then they've used my social security number, so now I've got to prove that I am the one that filed the FEMA. Tommy and Patricia say they will be okay. It's their children they're worried about. I know we'll be okay, but it's just them. They've never had to do this. The family is accepting all kinds of donations. That includes everything from furniture to money. I'll have information on where you can donate on our website, suntextproud.com. Noelle Mendoza, Fox 44 News.